So, Maria Sharapova, thank yes. you for being with us today. Thanks for we are me. so excited to have you. We are here at a Nike shoot. What are we doing? Yes, we're actually doing some still shots um, of a train. It's a training campaign, so um, I'll be doing some stuff, and it's all like in this black theme and this very moody with powder, and then the special effects will go on after the shoot. But it's all in black outfits, and then after we're gonna do um, some PR shots of all of my outfits for next year. You look great. By Thanks. The way. This is actually an old dress. Oh, okay, so it's not. <laughs> it is. This is an old dress. No, this is one of the old dresses. But it was in black, okay. so the shot had to be in a black dress. So we used this one. I like it. And, Thank you. And more importantly, let's just talk about some good things. Thanks. One Tokyo. Yes. Okay. So so exciting. How do you feel about your game right now? I'm, I was just thrilled. Yeah. Um, you know, when you're coming back and uh, to win a title, and you know, unfortunately, I got a retirement in the final. But um, it was just it's so it's so exciting because you, you look back at all the work that you put into it, and you realize that it, it took you so long to get there, but it's so worth it. You know, to hold that trophy and to yeah. smile and laugh a lot, and you know. Know, go to dinner and know that you just won the tournament. Yeah. <laughs> it's the best a good part. feeling. It's a really good feeling to have. But then the next day you get on a plane and it's like it never happened again. So, but it was great. It was a great feeling, and I'm done for the season and um, just got back from vacation. So I feel really fresh. You and can't complain. You just got no, back from vacation. Where'd you go? I was in Napa with all my friends, and it was so wonderful. <laughs> I felt I haven't had a proper vacation in uh, in a couple of years. Yeah. So it was uh, it was great. I feel energized. Did you feel like you deserved go. it? Like after the win, you're I like, did. I deserve you know. It. Vacation. It's weird because I felt like throughout the year when I was doing rehab, like you'd think, oh, I'd have all this time to, to go and do things. But, you know, I'd have like one, two days of, of vacation, but I never actually had a whole week to go and get out. And I forced all my friends into it. And I was like, I don't care what we're your going. plans are. We're going. <laughs> you are making time. Uh -huh. And we're getting, we all, we loved, we loved it. Well, we look forward to the new year. Thank what are you. your goals for 2010? Um, well, I'm really looking forward to the off season. First of all, I think that'll be really important for me because I, I feel like I can create a good base for the next year, okay. and that's really important because I feel like this whole year I've kind of been playing catch up. Whether it was the shoulder, whether it was trying to get into sh into tennis shape, whether it was trying to get into um, you know match shape. So um, I feel like this will be a really good time for me to build on um, a few good things and, and a good end to the year. So yeah. I'm really looking forward to that. We talked briefly off camera about your workout. What yeah. are you doing? Um, well. Last week I just ate. <laughs> so we start with eating. Uh, yeah, we start with eating, and then when you realize that the pounds keep piling on, oh, you agree. Then you're like, okay, <laughs> what do I need to do? So I'm starting slow. I actually, yeah. I just, I just had a Pilates class with right. a friend of mine, and right. um, so I'm starting really slow, and then um, I start hitting tomorrow a little bit okay. and work myself into things and uh, keep working on the shoulder. I'll be going to Phoenix for maybe a week or so in the off season yeah. as well. So do a few things, and then I have a tour in Latin America that I'm doing against Gisela Dulco oh. and that's a part of the world I've never been to before so I'm so looking forward to it as well. That's great. Yeah. I think um, there's, a, there's a lot of exciting things going on especially mm. in the women's game. Mm -hmm. uh, your opinion about the comeback queens. We've got Kim yeah, Chrysler, you do. Justine Anna. What <laughs> do you so think great. about that? There's such great storylines for the sport. Um, you know, it, it's so great to have past champions. I feel like, I don't know, Lindsay's going to be coming back. When's, yeah. Jenna, when's Jennifer <laughs> Capriati coming know, back? We just need a couple more, and I we've know. got the whole the whole group. Mm -hmm. um, it's so exciting. I mean, I, I think it's awesome for the sport. Um, you know, I'm, I'm sure many of the girls were, you know, watching TV and, and saying, you know, I want to be back out there. Because mm -hmm. at the end of the day, we do this from a, from a very young age. And, um, you know, when you just give it up, when you stop, you, I mean, you get bored at a certain yeah. point. In time yeah. and uh, you know we're such competitors and there's nothing that can really match that. I was just gonna say really when you nothing. compete on this level, it's yeah. hard to just retire, have it, a baby. Well, oh, I would not. Yeah, no, I but would know. not that you're not. No, not that I know. Not that I know. Not that I know anything about that. But no. isn't it hard just to give it, it up really and walk is. away? It is. I mean, it was something that I dealt with during my injury. It was it was so strange to not have that as just a routine. And even you know just that the training part and obviously that's what gets you better. But at the end of the day. It's the competition that really drives you. It's um, it's what you want. And sometimes when you don't know if you're ever going to be back or you feel like maybe you've had too much, and it's obviously a very tough schedule, and we're playing for 10, 11 months a year, and you, you look back and you're like, is it really worth it? But then when you're holding the trophy, you're like, well, maybe it is, it is and it is. And, and and I think while we can and while we're young, while our bodies are healthy and can do it, why not? Yeah. You know, why not? We, I mean, if you have the talent and if you have the time to work and give, you know, give 100% on the practice court and, you know, compete and go out there then but then why not do it right you know? well well that's well said you are such an ambassador of the sport you Thanks. know i know you're so young but you've been around <laughs> thank you. forever thank you thank so you much, much. Yeah, for no talking problem. to tennis no channel problem. we adore you thank you so much <laughs> thank you pleasure to meet <laughs> Thanks you a lot. Right. Yeah. good luck today <laughs> Thanks.